Mike, he's got two of these lights. Water's getting into them. What we could do, get a little piece of galvanized steel. Um, be careful of the dirt dauber that's living in the damn thing too. Um, kind of shoot a little sliding board over the end. He's got another couple lights to install over that. He may want us to seal what I'm walking on. Wow, one heck of a slide. <coughs> anyway. Okay. He's on the other side. This is the second light. I got it. Got it? I got it. Okay. It's the same fixture. They both need to come down. Sure. There is caulking around uh, I the, see. the housing. Sure. And yeah. that all needs to come off. Sure. We'll pull those out and then we'll have to fight this out, but we got a knife. We can score it. It'll I pop have, out. I have one for you too. Good, um, good. What we, what, now, the next question, Lee, yeah. is behind the square white box right. where the light is mounted to. Yeah. Is water possibly getting in through the back? Well, the box is there. It's a J channel, so that the water is is um, meant is prohibited. It's prohibited. Yeah. So I, I think mean, with that flashing, I think we'll keep the water off. Of it. Oh, I would. I, I wouldn't touch that for nothing in the world because uh, yeah. See, you've got a box outside that sticks out an inch. Yes, sir. And there is a a, a, a forward piece that goes to to the board, and behind it, it sticks out double that. Right. All the way behind it. Yes. Sir. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, sir. I agree. Um, do you all do senior citizen discount? Sure we do. You do? Okay. Yep. How much for both lights being changed out? Well, let me let me talk to Mike, because he's actually the craftsman to be quoted. Now, I'm kind of the legs here. He was supposed to be here yesterday, but we goofed. Yeah. And I live very close to you around the corner in Gardner. Oh, good. So I was going to... Um, good, good. Close to Timber Drive. All right, yeah. I yeah, know where it is. yeah. And I was going to come out here for him and just make some pictures and is stuff. Is that the name of the business? Yeah, craftsman, craftsman Direct. Direct. Yes, sir, it is. Good. It is. Yep. Yeah. Now, the <clears throat> next question is. Yep. Yep. That back ramp. Yep. I need to get some kind of sealant on it. Yep. So the wood doesn't rot. It's mm -hmm. starting to bend a little bit now. Sure. But I'm gonna need that ramp also. Okay. Uh, see his stain over there? That's a little bit dark. Yep. I would like something a little bit lighter. Okay. Um, with a sealant. Can you pick out a color? I could. And we can put any color you want on it. Okay. Any product you want. Okay. And we'll do the application. What about this one? This one, my brother told me that we can put a, uh, there's a co coat that you put on it. Yep. And it takes up all the old paint. Yeah, it's a, a remover. A remover. Yep. Yeah. It does. This is this looks like latex paint. It is. <clears throat> yep, it does. It, it looks is. like latex paint because it's flaking like paint. Yeah. Yep, I agree. You could do that. Let it sit on here, paint it on, and and it'll. Uh, you can spray it off with water. <clears throat> but yeah, outside it looks real good. Yeah, the outside doesn't look too bad. Sure it does. Yeah. I've been here 16 years now. Wow. Yeah. And if you saw the inside, you would be shocked. Yeah. Now, I got one more thing for you. All right. How you all do on uh, door locks? Uh, not real well. Not real well. Not real well. I wish we did, but uh, okay. they give us a fit. Okay. Yeah. Um, uh, I'll, I'll work on trying to get my brother to come out and rechange it. Okay. My deadbolt is not. Yeah. The tumbler keeps turning. Sure. And the deadbolt doesn't come out. Well, I'll ask Mike and, and yeah. you know, deadbolt, but if, if he feels good about quoting it, then uh, we can do it. 